Hi everyone, Joe for Jaspi's CaseBreaks.com coming at you with 2019-2020 Panini Donneries Optic Basketball Blaster Edition, 10 boxes. The second half of that case we popped open a little bit earlier. This is break 16. We sold 15 spots. One spot gets you two. And there's all the teams right there. Let's roll it and randomize each list. Four and a three, seven times for each list. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seventh and final time. After seven, we've got Liam down to Derek. Four and a three, seven times for the teams. Two, three, four, five, six, and good luck. Seventh and final time. After seven times, we've got the Spurs down to San Antonio, not the An Antonio, San Antonio Spurs down to the Orlando Magic after, no, I don't want to search these. I'm going to copy these. There you go. Got it. So Liam, you have the Spurs, Derek with the Thunder, Derek Melanson with the Kings, Rob with the Bulls, Last Spot Mojo, Jack with the Clippers, Liam with the Rockets, Brett with the Nets, David with the Jazz, Rob with the Nuggets, Liam with the Sixers, the X-Line with the Warriors, Liam with the Mavs, Brandon with the Pels, Liam with the Hornets, Brandon with the Knicks, Derek with the Suns, Jack with the Hawks, Derek with the Cavs, Liam with the Celtics, the X-Line with the Lakers, Derek with the Heat, Chris with the Bucks, David with the Grizz, Brett with the Raptors and Wizards, Chris with the Blazers, Brett with the Pistons, Diane, Timberwolves and Pacers, and Derek Melanson, and Orlando Magic. Any trades? Should I pause the video? I'll pause the video for a couple of moments and see if there's any trades. And when we come back, we'll see if there's any trades. And they'll have the brakes stick around. BRB. And we're back. And there's a trade between the Derricks. Derek Melanson and Derek Ewing. So Derek is out of the heat spot and into the Cavs spot here. So that Derek Ewing. We'll put T next to his team for trade till we know who draws first blood in the trade. And Derek Melanson now has the Miami Heat. There you go. Now let's print. Let's rip. Good luck. All right, Jack. Be a battle of the derelicts, perhaps. All right. Good luck, Derricks, and everybody else in this one. Let's switch over to this screen right here. You can see all ten boxes right here. I just grabbed it from my seat in the back. So we'll open these five at a time right here. Good luck, everybody. We'll have some more basketball coming up in a little bit. But sandwiched in between the two basketball breaks will be uh, 2017 five-star baseball. So baseball fans, if you're waiting for that, it's going to happen right after this. This hopefully shouldn't take more than another 20 minutes or so. That five-star baseball should be like five or ten, which should be maybe less than ten minutes. And then we'll dive into that cello pack break to give away the final mixer spots. And then we'll do the mixer itself, which should pretty much take the remainder of our evening. And then we'll, uh, we'll call it from there. And then we'll reconvene tomorrow for a uh, brand new release, Tribute fa uh, Baseball, Tribute Tops Tribute Baseballs. Drops tomorrow. Jason Jaspi will be live early tomorrow, ladies and gentlemen, 11 a.m. Pacific. 11, 12, 1, 2 p.m. Eastern, a few hours earlier than we normally go live. So he's going to get uh, get that Tribute Baseball kick-started, so pre-order that now. Um, he'll also uh, he'll also probably do some, some hockey for you hockey fans. He's a big hockey collector, big hockey fan. So if you want to break some hockey with him tomorrow, that cup will be should be delivered tomorrow and available. Hopefully in the morning. Hopefully a morning delivery on that one. Yes, and Jason will do the tribute random as well. Yeah, he'll do anything that fills tomorrow. For the few hours that he'll be on air. And then he'll do his normal personal break thing as well. Yeah. 
Busy, busy week for us, ladies and gentlemen. And ladies and gentlemen, I know a lot of people, hopefully everyone's being safe. We want everyone to be safe. We're being safe here. Hopefully you guys, are, guys and gals are being safe out there. But while we have some extra time, I think a lot of people are either working from home or forced to be indoors. Good time to sort through your collection, I want to say. Don't you think? Sort through, sort through your collection. Start weeding out stuff that you don't really want to keep anymore. Start selling some stuff. Start getting some stuff on eBay. We, From some of the uh, collectors in the area that we've been talking to, We've been hearing that the secondary market, uh, the secondary market's actually uh, pretty strong. One one guy told us yesterday he can't list things on eBay fast enough. They keep selling. <laughs> Jason gets days off. He must have switched Friday for something else. He was off that one Tuesday. He got three days recently which was a pre-planned trip that never happened because because of the COVID crisis. Yeah. yeah, we work it out. Oh, this week, oh, was that, was that the other week? Oh, it was last week then. What did, what did Kendrick Lamar say dedication was? Dedication. Hard work and preparation. Dedication. It's Kobe White. So not a lot of autographs in these blaster boxes, but it's these parallels that we're, is what we're looking for. It's Chris, these, these, those parallels are not numbered, but of course they will ship. Inserts will ship. Rated rookies will ship. LeBron James has to ship. Inserts will ship. Oh, did I print out the list right here? I did. So Josh Xline got randomized my Lakers. He'll get that LeBron James card, which which have carried value on the secondary market. Believe it or not, I think it's his first second year with the team, first year where, where the pictures are are in his Lakers gear. Yeah, Jack Santa Monica, I think has, I mean all of L.A. really, but Santa Monica has has seen a spike in in cases. But there's also a lot of, uh, I don't know, it's weird. I think there's, uh, there's also a lot more hospitals there. So I don't know how they calculate that. And I think in certain parts of Santa Monica as well, at Nice Zion, and Brentwood and whatnot, I think wealthier people who can who can afford to get tested earlier there's zion base zion going to brandon anderson who got randomized the pelicans but be safe out there everybody and while you're indoors you know you can work on uh work on cleaning up the collection a little bit getting some stuff on ebay putting a little extra hobby money in your pocket Get those projects done. Clean out the collection a little. The nice Cam Reddish checkerboard. It's a good time to do that, I think. Another thing, introduce introduce someone to the hobby. Whether it be a uh, a friend that you can you can hit up. Text and be like, yo, you want to join a group break? 
Nice Kobe White hollow for the Bulls. Rob, you know, if they were somewhat interested in the hobby, you can introduce them to Jaspies and group breaks, or at least invite them to watch. You can hang out in the chat with your friends since you can't see each other, coworkers or family members or something like that. Introduce someone to introduce someone into this craziness that we do. Share share an interest with them. Marcus Aldridge, DJ Augustine, and Bull Bull. All right, next five. Next five right here. Five star baseball coming up after this, and then the basketball mixer. Yeah, a couple nights. That base one was all right. The hollow, even better. And Kobe White has been one of the more promising rookies of this season. said this before I'll say it again I I remember last year people thinking that aside from Zion and RJ Barrett you know that it was a pretty thin draft class maybe I I mean I feel like leading up to the draft we were we were hearing that it's not going to be that deep you know a lot of these a lot of these you know players coming out of college are a little raw aside from Zion and maybe RJ Barrett but no, it just turned out to be a pleasantly deep draft class. Well, at least a collectible draft class. A lot of people chasing, you know, players like, you know, I've heard people chasing Romeo Lankford for the Celtics. Cam Reddish, you know, was starting to come on a little bit before things got halted. Kobe White for the Bulls. Tyler Hero. Kendrick Nunn on the Heat. Seku Demboya for the uh, for the Pistons, Zion obviously, R.J. Barrett obviously, but then there was John Morant for the for the Grizzlies. And um, so there are some names out there, and then you then maybe even some longer shot names, maybe some buy low candidates. You know, you can pick one of the you can either pick Eric Pascal or maybe Jordan Poole. For the Warriors, I mean, that that could be a buy low there. I think Jarrett Culver for the Timberwolves was a, is a top 10 pick. I mean, he hasn't really shown, but he still has a ceiling, you know. So he's got room to grow and evolve. Same with what about Darius Garland on the Cavs. That's another pick that, that can still evolve into a big name. So now, now I'm hearing now, now that this upcoming NBA draft is another thin class, according to the so-called experts, you know, so, so what am I to believe? It's coming up next, Risker, after these stack of cards here. I'm running a little behind schedule here.
All right, last handful of boxes. Good luck, everybody. This is 2019-2020 Panini Donners Optic Basketball Blaster Break Random Team Number 16. Thanks, everyone, for getting in. Veteran Commons won't ship, but this Kevin C. Kevin Porter Jr. is another name. You know, maybe not as highly touted as a Darius Garland, but another rookie that can show promise. I think there's some promise in this draft class. No, this case is not produced. And isn't there usually, doesn't Donner's Optic usually have one? Like a few autographs in here? Or am I thinking of Prism Blasters? No, yeah, Blaster exclusive. You can get rated rookie signature checkerboard number to one, but I thought there were, I thought there were like a, a few autos at least per Blaster case. Michael Bridges, Donovan Mitchell, Hollow Matisse Tybel for the Sixers, Liam Mahoney. This is a uh, another guy that they really like, especially for his uh, his defense. Defense being praised, which is unique for young players. Nice R.J. Barrett, rated rookie. No, the reddish checkerboard not numbered. Just has checkerboard across the back, but not numbered. I think maybe if it's an autograph, it would be a one of one, is what the box seems to suggest. Oh, there's an autograph. Got a play to the whistle. Nicolo Melli, signature series for the Pelicans. Brandon Anderson. He's been getting some minutes, Nicolo Melli. So he's been on the court. He's getting minutes. There you go. Yeah, that is the wrong Pelican, though, yeah. Snolly, Tremont Waters, Eric Pascal, Will Barton. Getting near the end here. And if we if we pulled a Zion autograph out of Donner's Optic Blaster boxes, woo. Derek Melanson with the Kings with this guy. All right. And there you have it. Break 16 in the books. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next break. Bye-bye.